New is your local election headquarters with one week until primary day in Missouri. A new exclusive Fox to the Hill Emerson College Missouri poll is out on the Missouri U.S. Senate race and the new polling shows a huge change atop the Republican race. Also tight numbers on the Democratic side. Fox 2's Mike Colombo has a breakdown. In the final week before the primary, the biggest headline to come from our latest polling is that Republican Attorney General Eric Schmidt now has a double digit lead. 33% of the 1,000 likely voters in the Missouri Republican primary say they'll vote for Schmidt on August 2nd. 21% say they'll vote for Congresswoman Vicki Hartzler. 16% say they'll vote for former Governor Eric Greitens. This latest polling shows a dramatic drop for Greitens. Just last month, polling from the same group had Greitens in the lead with 26%. Political analyst Joe Cernick believes Republican voters are getting serious about choosing a candidate they're confident can win in November. As people start to remember Greitens and the problems he had when he was married and why he lost the governorship, and then some of his silly ads, I think, have turned off people in a very big way. The polling shows 50% of voters view Greitens as very unfavorable, while 17% view him as very favorable. Spencer Kimball of Emerson College Polling explains. I would say that over the course of the last five or six weeks, there's probably been a negative advertising towards Greitens, and that seems to have impacted voter attitudes. According to Open Secrets, the conservative Show Me Values PAC has spent more than $7 million against Eric Greitens. Cernick says the key now is securing undecided voters. The undecideds are leaning towards Schmid in the Republican primary. But it's a weekend, and so that means undecided, they make up their mind at the last minute. And so whoever blitzkriegs the TV commercials in the next few days. On the Democratic side, Anheuser-Busch heiress Trudy Bush-Valentine has a small lead over Marine veteran Lucas Kuntz. 39% of Democrats say they plan to vote for Bush-Valentine. 35% say they plan to vote for Kuntz. 48% of black Democrats have a very favorable view of Bush Valentine. Just 16% have a very favorable view of Lucas Kuntz. This is why we saw the Lucas Kuntz ad against Trudy Bush Valentine regarding uh, the ball is because she's winning the non-white vote nearly 50 to 10. Racial favorability aside, Cernick thinks Bush Valentine's experience in the medical field may endear her to Democratic voters. Does the Trump factor still loom large in the Missouri Senate race? We asked again if the former president's endorsement of a candidate would make those polled more or less likely to vote for that candidate. In June, 49% said they would likely be more willing to vote for that candidate. In our July poll, that number dropped to 41%. 10% said they'd be less likely to vote for the trump back candidate in June, but in July, 21% said they would be less likely to vote for the candidate endorsed by Trump. Mr. Trump has yet to endorse a candidate in the Missouri Senate race. I'm Mike Colombo, Fox 2 News.